got my friend here. Hey, it's Brandon Barnes about the E, that's me. Yeah, the baddest bitch, period. And Madame Acra. And she's the baddest bitch too, period. <laughs> <laughs> so today's just a girly video because what I want to know, obviously you guys have met Acra and obviously Brandon on, on back chat. And what I want to know is I just want like Acra to give us some tips because mm -hmm. some of us need sugar daddies. Do you like sugar daddies? I mean, when the money resides. Oh, when the money resides, bitch! When the money resides, bitch! <laughs> so, for us girls who need sugar daddies, um, sometimes your sugar doesn't even have to be like older, like even if he's a young thing, whatever, mm -hmm. whatever you, you find. We need tips on how to get that bag. What's the best way to get that bag from the sugar daddies? Um, so, Ikra, take it away. Tip one. Tip one. Okay, I don't know about the sugar daddies. Okay, where can we find a sugar daddy, first of all? I want to know where we can find them. Where you can find a rich man? Yes. Money. Money, okay. Where you can find a rich man? Go to where they are. Go to where the luxury stores are. Go to go on holidays. Which holiday should I go on? Monaco. Okay, girl, my friends want me Monaco. Okay, can I ask you a question? Okay, Monaco. Is it really affordable for me to go there? Yeah. In the yeah. season? In season? <laughs> How much is it? Like, how much is it really to how, go there? Like, are the girls gonna be able to afford to go to Monaco? Yeah. Or under a grand? Yes, you can. In in, in season. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Where else can we go to find a uh, rich um, hunk? Holidays. Hunk. Holidays. More holidays. More holidays. You need to go first class when you come. So have I got. Have I got excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse yeah. me. This is a startup pack. A startup. Yeah. Pack. We, we can't start afford. Up. It's giving startup. We can't afford first class. But you're saying once like, we. Upgraded to intermediate level, we should fly first class and we'll see. What you do is you come an hour men. early, you come an hour early, you sit in the lounges because that's where the men travel. Mm. Where they got the laptops and stuff. Um. Yeah, but they need those exclusive lounges, like you gotta get in there. Class. No, you you know you just need to no, she's telling us to buy a first class ticket and go to the first class lounge and hour two hours early, yeah. And then what do we wear mm. to the airport? You wear something like this. Um, you look on my Instagram page and you copy the fits. Okay. I don't care. Copy. Classy but sexy. Classy but Classy sexy. but sexy. So you're gonna travel for 12 hours dressed like uncomfortable. It's not uncomfortable. I'm perfectly fine. Because I'm giving tracksuit when I'm. Okay, so how do we how do we how do we know the guy that's got it versus the guy that don't? Mm. How can you tell? Okay. Can you tell? You gotta do a test. Mm -hmm. What's the test been? Okay, like I said before. You got to, okay. I didn't say this before. Actually, exclusive. So you got to come up with a dilemma. Mm. It can't be oh I can't afford my rent. It's not. That's giving dusty. Don't do that. Okay. Don't. It's giving dusty. That's okay. Because you can afford your you can afford your rent. You mm -hmm. can afford your car. It has to be like a dilemma. Like maybe my tire is bust or something. Mm. I don't know how much of that is. Like four hundred pounds. Maybe. Mm. If he doesn't replace it for you. He's stingy, get rid of him, throw him to the wayside. One thing I used to do, like, because I've got a small, small, I, okay, I'm not like as high level as you, but maybe I would say, like, amateur. I'm, I'm, I'm not, I wouldn't say I'm amateur, like, like, a little bit above beginner. Um, I, no, I'm not doing first class boo. But one thing I used to say to guys is, like, oh my god, like, my birthday's coming up. Yeah. Yeah, 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 because you don't know what my birthday is, Bill. Exactly. Oh, event, and then I'll be like, uh, and then he'll be like, oh my god, what are you doing? Oh, like, I would say that, oh, I'm looking for a dress. What dress do you want? And then you, you don't know how much my dresses cost. So I'll be like, I want this dress that costs, you know, 700 pounds. Yeah. But you know what? Some guys will actually want to see if you bought the dress. And I didn't. You buy it. Ah, buy it. I don't buy it. Turn it. Buy it in cash. Oh, return it. okay. Get the money back. Buy it and return Take a photo, show it to him. And then return it. And then, and then cash use back. it. And use it for yourself. And put that in your savings account. Clever. Word, 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 word. That is a good tip. Yeah. I never knew that. Get it in cash. You know, I did something really out of order in uni. I'm really ashamed of myself. Please don't judge me. I'm actually ashamed of myself. One guy <laughs> got me a new iPhone. Yeah. And I had a boyfriend at the time. Um, I wasn't sleeping with him. He was just yeah. like a, a rich footballer. Gave me an iPhone and I gave it to my boyfriend. Oh, that's giving dusty. <laughs> you should have sold it. That's, I mean. Get the money. Did you give it to him as a like we gift it? No, my boyfriend knew that I was talking to a rich guy, so I said to Ojo. That's true. I know how bad is that. But that boyfriend is a dusty. Yeah, he's dusty. He's dusty. He but took back it, in the day, he I took it with his chest. Yeah, he's not a man. But I know. But back in the day, I was dusty. It's okay. You elevate. I've elevated, baby. You grow. Oh, we grow. We grow. Mm. I'll never do that again. If how you, embarrassing! I worked for that. I oh did the com I, I, I did the conversation. <laughs> I deserved it. Yeah. I was so embarrassing. Okay, give us another tip, baby. Yeah, because you should have sold that. Don't come out of pocket. Don't come out of pocket. 
when you go into a relationship or dating stage, you need to come up with positive equity. Okay. Maybe he cared about you more. Maybe he gave you a bit of money. Maybe he taught you something. What is that? Mm -hmm. Positive equity. What is write that? it down in your notes. Get your notepad. Your note pen. Write it I down. Mean, what about when you? What about if you actually like the guy? What we need to think about. Like. She's waiting to like the guy. Click on like. It's not because my point is. There'd be points where you'd be chatting to someone and they could be spoiling you, but not that they're your, I wouldn't say owned by You've them. You've got to be a like, bit of a narcissist though. Because my, like, that's what I mean, like, for me, if I would, if someone was to buy me too much, or buy me something, I'd be like, like, I'm, like, my point is, I'm like, no, it's fine, like, I'm one of those people like, it's fine, like, I've got my own bag, innit? But you're telling me I should just come with the, of like, keep it coming. You need to have a receiving spirit, you need to learn to receive. Just learn to receive, learn to lay back, mm. chill. Wow. So, okay. okay, what I want to know as well is another tip is, okay, so these men, I'm assuming some of them are married? No, I don't date married men. I, okay. Absolutely not. So I'm how not. do you, how do you, how do you find that out? Because I know some of them lie, darling. Okay, if, when he sends you, okay, this is tea. <laughs> when he sends you money to your account, you'll see his full name, his first name, last name. Okay. You put it in LinkedIn. Okay. You put it in Facebook. Okay. You put it in Google. Okay. Uh, you reset. Why don't you go to uni to get a degree? Uh huh. To, to search. Uh -huh. To search. Use your skills. That's so Okay. Thing. Wait. But is it because you're not really dating? You're not trying to marry them. But is it okay to just finesse a married man? You're not. You're not giving him the bum bum. I don't agree. No. No. I'm asking you why because you're not actually sleeping with him. No. No. It's just that that doesn't go with my morals. I'm not here for the marriage. Okay. Cool. No. No. Once I find out. Yeah. 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 Okay. I don't destroy family. <laughs> That's not destroying family. Is that it? Will you a gift? Really? Well, you're not sleeping with him, though. No. Okay. The fact if you go on a date with him, then that is naughty. No. If you, if you go on a date with him, that is naughty. Mm. But if I'm, if a married man, what if a married man said to me, "Oh, Lance, can I send you ten grand?" I'm not gonna say, "Oh my God, no, you're married." Send me the money. I'm oh. um, send me the money, baby. Then maybe after I'll book you. I'm like, this because... is my store code. This is my. <laughs> <laughs> Period. Period. Boo. Oh. Do you think that you could um, date a sexy, rich older man? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What's your type? It's given. It's given that uh, I like men. Wait. Do you have? Wait. I want to ask you something. Do you date any race? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Just as long as they're sexy. It's, to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. Okay. Cool. So there you go. Also, would it's you given, say? It, oh. Doesn't even, even matter what they identify as, like. Which? Yeah. You date straight men like, as well. Yeah. Like. Swing my way. Because I want to know something about you. Wait, so you see the whole rich thing. Would you say there's a race that's better if for, for beginners? What race should they prefer? Should we go for the white men? Go for any. Who are the most generous, darling? I think the African guys are the most generous. Really? Yeah, the Caribbeans. I don't know about that. Well, more than more than really? more than the white men. I'm here for the white men too. Are they more? Are they the same generous as African men? I think African men are more generous, yeah. but the white men are generous too. Okay, well, there you go, guys. Um, I want to thank you. Wait, I've got a question. Wait, okay, well, just, the tea. All right, just said something. Sorry, it's well, I want to know what if a guy was spoiling you, but you could tell he was going, like, he was going broke spoiling you? I'll keep going, man. I'll keep going, man. I'll keep going, man. <laughs> Keep going so you can't go no more. So you, you saw that, say for example, you, you see him like, he's struggling to pay, he's, he's getting credit cards upon credit cards, but he's, he's fueling you. You're just taking it. I, you know what, I can't do that because I'll be a hypocrite. No, because I'll be a hypocrite because I'm on the internet crying about being finessed by someone when I was broke. So I couldn't do that. But he was a liar, he was a fraud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not a liar or a fraud. Oh, You're a receiver. But I need to know. I need to know better. But anyway, I still love you. Still yeah. love you, boo. So it's giving. We'll put our sort code and account numbers in the comments. That's what it's giving. <laughs> so guys, if you want to be like, Ikra, I mean, who wouldn't want to be like My Queen Ikra? Ikra? Who wouldn't like? <laughs> she is just goals upon goals upon goals. I don't think you. Okay, even though I've done this video, I just want you to know, like, it's 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 a bit of banter, but mm -hmm. I don't think that everyone has to live traditional in the traditional way. I don't think we all have to look for love or whatever. Do what's best for you. Yeah. What's mm -hmm. best for your mental health and what you want. Yeah. Because half of us are out here looking for love and are just getting used and abused by men, women, crying every day, our mental health mm -hmm. is tapped. So pick which lane you want to go down. Prioritize. Right, if you want somebody to look after you, you do that and you do that with your chest. Mm -hmm. I hope you got some good tips in this video. And make sure you follow these 
amazing superstars. I love them both. They're amazing yeah, people. Right. Okay, until the next video. Bye! Bad B. They stay looking, but these brothers can't have me. They call me